So how do you feel about the care, the level of care that a loved one is getting? Maybe, maybe you have a, a parent or a, a wife or a husband that is receiving senior care, whether that is in the home, uh, you have caregivers in the home helping that person, or if you have a situation where you're already found a care home or assisted living, are they receiving the proper level of care? It may be, maybe if, uh, if a parent of yours is in assisted living, but they're having memory care problems and they're going unaddressed, what type of risk is that really putting them in? You know, I mean, falling for somebody who is in that situation can be very detrimental and can, can lead to a whole series of changes in their life that makes things very difficult. Well, I'm not here to just completely freak you out, but you know, I do want to know how you feel about that because I help local people uh, find caregivers for the home or I help them find uh, senior living solutions. The process is very simple. My process is I listen to you for about 20 minutes to find out the situation. And then I, I kind of go through a little analysis and assessment of, of what's going on. And then I'll um, give you some options, whether those are caregiving options, find caregivers for your parents or a loved one, or if we're going to go out and tour some of the facilities, I come with you um, and uh, make sure that we ask all the right questions and we're seeing the places that really fit to what you need or what your parent might need. Typically, I'm talking right now to somebody who's very busy, who doesn't really have time to do all these things or do all the necessary research to make sure that you're making the best decision possible. Even if you've already made that decision somewhere else along the line, it might be a time where you go in and make a new decision. I always say that you always have to make the best decision for where you're at at the time. So if you're not sure, or if you are feeling like maybe things should be better for uh, my loved one, then I invite you to give me a call. I hope to hear from you soon. I know that I can provide a lot of value for you. All right, see ya.